So have you ever thought about like how our body moves, um, how our muscles move and uh, how all that works? Well, actually um, everything comes from our brain um, through nerves, through messages that um, go from our muscles and back out into our muscles and our muscles move our bones. And that's basically how, how the body moves. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about um, two nerves, our sensory nerves and our motor nerves, and that's that's how everything moves in the body. So sensory nerves are, um, they are in our muscles um, and they take the message of whatever needs to happen um, up into the brain and take, take some, I'll say um, to, into the spinal cord and or the brain. And sensory nerves are also called afferent nerves because the, the message is going towards um, towards spinal cord or towards the brain. Then the brain takes that information and process it, figures out what to do, sends the signal back as a motor nerve because it needs to move. So the message is moving. Um, well, the message is a moving message, a message to move. And so it's a motor nerve. That's kind of easy how to remember that. And that's called efferent, um, meaning uh, going away. So, so sensory nerve, sensory nerves and motor nerves are also uh, afferent nerves and efferent nerves. And when I say that the message from a sensory nerve goes to to the spinal cord and or the brain, there is one type of message being sent that does not have time um, to go up to the brain because it needs to protect our body, and that's just that quick reflex we have. So have you ever thought about like when you touch something hot and your hand moves away before you before you even realized that that you moved it? It's just kind of like it did it automatically. Well, um, so the sensory nerve, like let's say right here in this area where you touched um, something super hot, um, that sensory nerve sends a message into uh, our spinal cord. It goes into the back of the spinal cord message is relayed right in there the message comes out as a motor nerve in the front of the spinal cord comes back out to our finger and tells it to move and that has to happen so quick that that information happens within our um within our vertebrae within the spinal cord area it doesn't have time to go up into the brain because it needs to it needs to protect our body it needs to happen super quick I did a video about holding your stretch for 30 seconds and that's how you get the best stretch. And I talked about the reason why you needed to hold for 30 seconds. And that's because there's this whole process of how the sensory nerve sends a message to the brain. The brain processes it, sends it back out as, um, as a motor nerve. So the, the reflex um, nerve to protect our body if we touch something super hot um, can't take all that time. Um, our, our skin would already burn. So that's the one exception when I say um, the message goes to our spinal cord and or the brain. So from here on out, I'm just gonna say the brain. So then how do our muscles move just kind of in a, um, in just an ordinary fashion, um, an ordinary situation? We have muscle spindles in our muscles and the uh, sensory receptors in those muscle spindles um, send a message through the sensory nerve into our brain detecting um, the speed and uh, length at which changes are being um, made in our muscles. The brain takes that information, processes it, sends information back out through a motor nerve that goes into our muscles and then that, that tells the muscle how to move. And that's basically how we get movement in, um, in our body. And that's through nerves. Um, there's a whole nother process of what's going on specifically inside the muscle with um, calcium and protein and sarcomeres and all that kind of stuff, which I'm not gonna go into here. This is just a basic, how our body moves, it's through nerves um, and uh, sensory nerve takes the message to our brain, tells our brain what's going on in the muscle, the, mus uh, the brain processes that sends the message back out to our muscles as a motor nerve, which causes the, the muscle to move in um, whatever fashion that uh, the brain detected the muscle needed to move. And that's just kind of a basic overview of just kind of how the body moves. 
So if you uh, like the video, please uh, hit the like button. Um, also subscribe to my channel. I'll be doing um, a lot more videos all about the body, anatomy, movement. Um, as a massage therapist, I'll be doing some stuff about massage as well. Mm -hmm. So thanks for watching.